Hello, freaks and geeks, and welcome to another episode of Fallout 4 Survival Mode. And, well, this, uh, this episode, we're gonna go raider hunting, and possibly super mutant hunting. I, by judging by the, uh, yeah, green skins. I'm guessing that's super mutants. But either way, that's what we're gonna be doing for today's episode. Uh, doing some uh, chores up chores up in the north. Uh, Glung fungus. Sure, why not? Um, gonna also keep an eye uh, eye out for some gears. Anything that contains gears. Because we need to build some... Uh, another turret for the outpost. What exactly is this? Oh, wow. That, that's uh, some, some radiation. What exactly is going on? down there um okay did the mole rats just fling that body uh i'm guessing they i'm guessing so at times like this i wish i had a Rocket launcher. Hello. Oh, hello. Should e be easily, or I should be able to take you down easily. Oh, okay, they already went back underground. Oh, there you are. Alright, I heard you grunting. Ow. I like how they quickly appear really fast next to me. It's like that's it's a little ridiculous. I'm gonna pop up right here. Oh yes. Yes you are. Should be able to take you down easily. Alright, I do believe that takes care of that. The Deliverer is so good. <laughs> oh, there's still another glowing mole rat? There's, there's a ton of you here. Rotten Lenfield. Well, I mean, that, that seems about right. Oh, hello! I didn't see you there. Is this actually... Oh, it does! How... How did you miss that? Alright, I thought that would be... I thought that rabid mole rat would be a lot worse. <laughs> Oh, really? Oh, might as well go ahead and take out the rest of these mole rats. Ooh, nice, uh... Nice ammo there. Oh, I should probably actually take the pulse mine. I should probably actually... take care of this infection. Antibiotics, and I'm thirsty. Well, good thing we have plenty of water. Alright, I guess I'm gonna go to County Crossing first, since that's closer. Whenever I'm actually next in town, I should think about getting a rad... a uh, rad... Wait, Tim Pine's Bluff is no, like, no longer allied to me. Wait, huh? Wait, what? I thought that couldn't happen. That's... Odd. 
Okay. Huh. I didn't know that could happen. Huh. Well, I guess what I was saying in the uh, in last ep week's episode, I guess we uh, definitely need to improve our settlements then. Uh, boost our charisma up. And, uh... Wait, what? Wait, what is this? Is this that... Town... Where they're trying to... Root out sense. Because if it's that town... Because I've ran across that town before. What was it called? Um... Oh, I'm forgetting the name of it. Covenant, yes! I've been here before in a different playthrough. I know exactly what, uh, what this is, actually. Um, should I get distracted? Yes. You here visiting Covenant, pal? If not, move along. You know, I'm people loitering around. Not good for the nerves. Uh, yeah. What's that what this place is called? Yeah, we're a real up-and-comer. A pit stop on the road for traders and such. We're not that big, but we got the bargains. Got a dock that can patch you up. We even got some lemonade. Well, that's what Deezer calls it anyway. There's a small catch, though. We don't just let anyone inside. There's an entrance test. We call it the safe test. Everyone's got to take it. Now, I know I just said, uh, basically, well, you know, if you actually never heard of this mission before, I'm going to go ahead and do it and not... Well, I guess I kind of spoiled a part of it, but uh, but you know what? We're just going to go through it like I don't know anything. And to, to be honest, I haven't played this mission in a while, so I don't know the little details ins and out of it. So I'm going to go ahead and just go through this and yeah. Let's, uh, yeah, let's go through this like we don't know what's going on. I mean, to be honest, I, like I, like I just said, I don't really know the little uh, bits and pieces of this mission. I just kind of know the ending to it, so, yeah, sounds reasonable. Being cautious. Not a bad call. You do what you gotta do. You wanna take the test? Pass it, and I'll let you in. I guess. Take a seat, and we can begin. I wish there was a sarcastic option. So let's begin. There ain't no wrong answers. You are approached by a frenzied scientist who yells, I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. What's your response? Oh yeah, I... <laughs> I forgot that they... that these questions were a, uh... a callback to Fallout 3. Uh, yeah. I wouldn't worry. If he did that, it'd cause parabolic destabilization of the fission singularity. Uh, yeah. Next question. <laughs> While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection on his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading at an alarming rate, but the doctor has stepped out for a while. What do you do? Uh, hmm. Medicate. You medicate the infected area as best I can. You have a medical background. You discover a young boy lost in a cave. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears to be in possession of stolen property. What do you do? Uh, do the right thing. I lead the boy to safety, then turn him over to someone in charge. Very curious. Congratulations! Hey, you made it onto a baseball team. Which position do you prefer? Uh, uh, I, I prefer soccer. I don't play baseball. I play soccer. Are you certain about that? Never mind. Next question. Your grandmother invites you to tea, but you're surprised when she gives you a pistol and orders you to kill someone. What do you do? Uh, throw tea in Granny's I face. I throw my tea in her face. Y yes! <laughs> Old Mr. Abernathy has locked himself <laughs> in his quarters again, and you've been ordered to get him out. How do you proceed? Uh... Pick the lock. I grab a bobby pin and pick the lock. Even though I don't As know I how to do? pick locks. Nothing else? <laughs> Wait, don't answer. Next. Oh, no. Huh. You've been exposed to radiation, and a mutated hand has grown out of your stomach. What's the best course of treatment? 
Now, <laughs> for this character in particular, I'm not going to say uh, B, but <laughs> in classic Fallout, or in Fallout 3, I always, whenever it comes to this question, I always go for bullet bullet to the brain because it's it's too funny not to um at least in context with this question but uh but yeah uh for my character i don't know for for this playthrough and you know this character in particular medicine i dose myself with anti-mutagen agent ignoring possible yes a neighbor is in possession of a grognak the barbarian comic book issue number one you want it What's the best way to obtain it? Trade. I trade him for one of the comic books I own. Hmm. You're almost done. Last question. You decide it would be fun to play a prank on your father. You enter his private restroom when no one is looking, and... I always either go with Sabotage Toilet or Flood Room. Which, honestly, I think it's like they're both the same thing, aren't they? I honestly don't really know. Uh... A flood room. I'd loosen bolts on his water pipes. When he turns on the sink, he'll be in for. A oh, time. okay. So general, basically the same thing. No one's ever answered quite like you, but hey, you passed. I'll open up the gate. Oh, am I standing in your way? I was about to say, don't break on me now. Ooh, wonder glue. Might have to steal that in a bit. Welcome to Covenant. Head on in. Penny's shop is usually the first stop. Hmm. Thank you. Wait, why did you... <laughs> Why did you close me in? That's Being already nice, but I got a mountain of work to do. Um I see that. Uh, I guess I will, yes, I, I will have it, I will harvest your, uh, work. Hi. Hello. Oh, oh, I heard about you. You're the stranger. What are you talking about? I just came. The store. <laughs> I oh, just walked in. I'm Talia. It's so nice to meet you. Hey. You're gonna like it here. Everyone in Covenant is so friendly and really wants to help. Too bad the rest of the Commonwealth isn't that way. I know. Wouldn't it be great if everyone looked out for each other? Feel free to use my tools. And if you need anything, just let me know. Hmm, sounds socially awkward like myself. The caravan came a few days back. Worked for old man Stockton. You saw him, right? I already told you. I don't recollect. We get in a lot of traffic. This isn't Diamond City. A caravan of five comes through, you'd remember. Then they must not have come through. <laughs> Honest Dan. My job here isn't drinking lemonade. I know for a fact they came here. Why the brush off? I want to well, help. Hello. But I really don't like what? Hey. Oh, words. I'll get to the bottom of this. You from around here? God, I hope not. Not enough of these hicks. <laughs> okay. That, I mean... That, that doesn't really give me a good first impression of you. Uh... You yeah. have a problem with the people here? All the fake smiles and the fancy talking puts me on edge. The sooner I'm out of here, the better. Do you know anything about Stockton's caravan? Well, I mean... I mean, I know of Stockton, but, I mean, I don't didn't know he had a caravan. Uh, I mean, I, oh, okay, well, I mean, I want to tell... Okay, you know what, never mind. I'm just going to say I know nothing about it. <laughs> no. I can't say that I do. I just can't. Good answer. I signed on with old man Stockton to find his lost caravan. What's left of it is just outside of town. The last stop was here, so I've been trying to put together the story. But I keep getting the runaround. Got a proposal for you. Help me find Stockton's people, and we split the reward. At least one survivor walked out of that massacre. And I intend to make good on my contract. Who are we looking for? The big one is Stockton's daughter, Amelia. I didn't find any bodies of the feminine persuasion. So, uh, there's hope. If we find her, Stockton's offering a heap of caps. Sounds sure. fair. I'm in. Here's all I got on the caravan. I don't got proof, but Covenant's involved. Somehow. I'll keep poking around, but let me know if you find anything.
All right, let's uh, let's look at the details. Stockton's hollow tape. Uh, wait a minute. Is this it? Or update observed unusual. Oh no, it's it's not. Ah. Ah, there we go. Uh. <laughs> okay, well that's not much information. Hello. Well, hello, stranger. The name's Jacob, and I run this town. Glad you passed the test. Our door's always open to good quality people. You can use one of the beds in the guest house. And you should visit Penny's store. Anything else in town? Doc Patricia will be more than happy to patch you up. For a modest fee, of course. Ah, you might want to stay there's actually a doctor in town. Dan. I've had some complaints about him. <laughs> Mr. Dan. Yeah, Can sure. I ask you some questions? Ask away. This place almost looks pre-war. How do you manage that? Hard work, shrewd trading, and a commitment to make a healthy community. It's a team effort. Yeah, Dan says you're lying. Dan says your people are lying to him. If you ask me, I think Dan's been baking in the sun too long. The only secret we've got here is what's in Deezer's lemonade. And if you can get Deezer to tell you, you just got to fill me in. As the robot says, it's delicious. Do you know anything about a missing caravan? Is this about those Stockton people? I've told Mr. Dan many, many times. We never saw them. Okay, then. I have to go. You have a good day. Hmm. <laughs> oh god, okay, master lock. Why does one tiny settlement need so much firepower? Oh uh, yeah, good observation. I mean, there's tons of turrets. I mean, if I was to set up that many turrets, uh the defense would be out of the route, out of the wazoo. Who are you? What and what are you doing in the building that can't be accessed? I'm not even going to bother with a robot because I know there won't be anything. Oh, kitty cat. Won't be able to pick this. Ah. Wait, why is the why is that Why is the doctor locked off for me? You don't need the meds. You got to lay off. Understood? Any other complications with the injury? It's healing up pretty good. Off you go then. Thanks, doc. I am peering through you through the glass. Hello. Huh. Everything is now locked. Or at least. Why did everything become locked? Huh, public terminal turn public terminal. Our friendly Mr. Handy even offers free lemonade. Hmm. What does the robot make it out of? His uh, motor oil or something? Well, I would go into your store if it was if <laughs> if the doors wasn't locked. anti vulgarity, mental, mental health. Okay, people who fail the te test is nice. due to mental health. Sure. All right. Yeah. Sure. Let me in. Let me in. Have time for some questions? If it'll help, sure. Everyone around here is acting suspicious. What are they hiding? Hiding? Why would you think that? We're just real friendly and busy. I, I gotta go. <laughs> All right then. Well, hello. Why is all the buildings locked now? Alright, I just slept, and hopefully... Okay, no, everything's still locked. That's still locked. Why are you just standing there like a doofus? Let me in! I can't even get into the, to the store. I hate this place. Yes, I hate it too! Hey, Dan. This whole place has got me on edge. I hope you found something on the caravan. Do you have any other leads? No. If 
Covenant doesn't pan out, then I don't know where to start. I'll cross that road if I have to. Have any advice on what I should investigate? They keep the barracks locked up tight. Find a way in, and I'm sure you'll turn up something. But leads could be anywhere, really. Do you have any proof Covenant is involved with the caravan? I got one thing. They deny up and down that Stockton's men ever came here. But they most certainly did. There's no reason to bald face lie to me if they're not hiding something. I'll keep poking around. We'll talk later. Oh, an overdue book, huh? Okay, what if I talk to the robot? Hey, Deezer. What's the catch? No tricks, no gimmicks, just the best lemonade in Covenant, free to our special guests. I'm looking into a lost caravan. Can you help? You know what would be great for a lost caravan? Deezer's Lemonade! Voted best beverage in Covenant <laughs> three years straight! I knew I couldn't get anything uh, out of the robot. Uh, sure, I'll let me... Some. Enjoy! Huh, that is actually not that bad of a uh, healing item. Huh, the door closes by itself. Now, if I remember correctly, you can run in to the attacked caravan, like, up north? Or on the, like, the on this road going north. I think. I might be going in the wrong direction. I uh, just put on the map mark, or I just put, I, uh, I just put it as my active quest, and I think it, uh, I think it's pointing me, uh, in the right direction now. Ah, yes. So I was kinda right. The caravan was hit awfully close to Covenant, alright. Deezer's Lemonade, huh? Ah! The caravan definitely stopped in Covenant. Yeah, <laughs> that's the clue. Because I already had have some. Also, yeah, like there's Covenant, and there's the uh, there's a caravan over there. Like it's literally like over the hill. <laughs> Penny's shop is usually the first stop. You know, I'm not even gonna ask you. Oh, hello. Oh, you finally opened the door. Ahem. <laughs> Hello, stranger. You got anything that ails you? I'll fix you up for a fee. Yeah. Take a look at me, Doc. Why does she has a look like she's doped up on something? Uh, <clears throat> Enjoy your stay. Enjoy your stay. What? What? What the Enjoy hell? Enjoy your stay. I can't talk to you? Well, shit. Okay. I hope you found something on the caravan. Well, I did. Do you have any proof Covenant is involved with the caravan? No. I still have no proof. Uh, well, it. Well, I found some Deezer's lim lemonade. Uh, why? Why is it not showing up? Why? Why isn't it showing up? We'll talk later. Busted again. The third radio this month. Ted better get on this pronto. This cell means business. <laughs> Then why was someone standing in it before? Ah, there's a master lock. Oh, yeah, look, there's totally <laughs> handcuffs in the cigar. Interrogations is going on here. What do we have? Dealing with depression, the 12 stages of grief, and some self-help books. Quite the library here. Huh. Yeah, that, that... Huh. That, yeah, that actually piqued my curiosity whenever it said to... Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna steal your technical document, okay? Alright. Cool. Oh. I guess I shouldn't have done that. Well, I guess we're doing this now.
Uh, I didn't exactly want to do this, but I guess we're doing this. Oh my god. Well, at least I got him in a choke point. Goodbye, good, <laughs> goodbye to you. Another stim pack. <laughs> My God. <laughs> yeah, everything's fine. Wow, heavy machine gun turret. I see. Honest Dan, you're just walking around like nothing's happening. Ow. Just let it... Just let it shoot itself out for a second. Oh, wow, okay, I, well... You finally decided to show up, I guess. Goodbye! <laughs> oh, what the... Okay. Meanwhile, honest, da honest Dan is just sitting, sitting in the corner, smoking a cigarette, just not really bothered by what's going on at all. Uh, Deezer is also cool. <laughs> cool with me just murdering everyone. All this over a technical document. I hope it's worth it. You know what? It it went it went blue, but I'm still gonna I'm still gonna take him out. What do you have to say about that? Hey, Dan. This whole place has got me on edge. <laughs> I hope you found something on the caravan. Uh, we'll talk later. <laughs> yeah, we will talk later. You just have no comment on how I just... Uh... <gasps> ah! Okay! Alright, Diesel! Diesel! I was fine with letting you live, but then I guess... Alright. I guess me... Uh, I guess... Uh, uh... Whatever. I guess I'm gonna steal everything now. Where is the mayor? I do believe I turned him into mush. I could have sworn there was a, uh, a terminal password for that. Uh. Huh. Oh, wow. So. She. She was selling the store at an un. Stameable price, huh? Don't think I can pick this. Oh, hello, kitty cat. Glad you survived the destruction. Safe report. Oh, uh, 28% failure rate. Uh, zero failures. Huh. Okay.
I feel like I need to actually go into this terminal. Okay, yeah, so this was the... The mayor. Yeah, I did turn him to goo. N nice. Nice floating head there. Did I, like, break this quest by accident? <laughs> I guess this is my settlement now. I, yeah, I'm wondering why there isn't a password around. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay, it was right there in front of my face. I've been ser going around searching for ever. <laughs> All right. Hello there, Jacob. I mean, I knew this place had something to do with sense, but... Hmm, do they, are there, like, prejudices against sense, or do they have something against them? I mean, it would make sense. I kind of forget. Oh, wait a minute. No, I'm kind of remembering the end of the mission now. Uh... New to Covenant and given his past. He's a bit jumpy. On the bright side, his look... Inclusiveness makes him an idea ideal for running messages to the compound. Ah. When traders are not in town. Okay. Which which would be the guy I do believe Huntley is a was a farmer before I uh blew him to bits. Uh McGov McGovern. I T I, I do believe she's the one that I commented on her so uh Social awkwardness, so that that adds up. Fisherman's report. Uh, Mr. One's uh, name unknown, who has stationed himself at the Mist and Pines Pound. Doo -doo -doo. His <laughs> his new favorite fishing hole. Well, um, I guess it, <laughs> this didn't need to happen, really. Hey, Dan. You find out anything about the caravan? Yes. Yes, I did. They took the survivors to a compound. Then we're in business. I'll meet you there and we'll rescue ourselves some caravan hands. Oh, optional. Was that optional? Huh. Okay. Well, let's just swim there. Surely nothing bad can come of swimming over there. Hello. Hello, fishermen. <clears throat> People are mucking around the shore at all hours. Scaring my fish. All right, yeah. Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, I think I remember this area. Into the sewer we go. How did you beat me here? They're hiding something. I'm sure of it. Um, y yeah, I think we already have established that there were... Hiding this, at least. Oh, hello there. Outsiders aren't allowed. Why are you here? Uh, that's a red check. I don't think I will be able to pass that even with my stuff, so. Yeah, this is actually bad. Who are you? I'm asking the questions. Why are you here? Um, I'm here to rescue the survivors from Stockton's caravan. I can't let you do that. It's the same person. Oh, you're right there, Dan. Dan, why are you holding an invisible gun? Dan, I don't think that invisible gun is going to help you. Yeah, see, that, that invisible gun is not really doing you much good right now, is it? Oh, there you go. You just had to get downed once. This is fucking crazy. 
Oh, are you running? Why are you running? Hey, don't run into me. How am I detected? Oh, by the... By Dan. That's who's detecting me. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> that was violent as hell. How are the subject vitals? It's a little unsteady, but within. Who, who are you? What? What's... Ah! Son of a bitch! Do that! Ah! I will only say this once. Speak only when spoken to. Please continue. The subject is ready for baseline testing. Subject. Answer the questions quickly and with what first comes to mind. You're approached by a frenzied scientist who yells, I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber. What's your response? Is that... that safe test... No! Answer the question. I, I... I... I don't know. I don't know science stuff. I... ignore him. Ignore him, you say. Oh, fascinating. Uh, huh. Looks like they repurposed some old world sewers. I don't like the sight lines here. Plenty of opportunities for chained on the other side. Yeah, Dan actually makes a good point. This is dangerous. Holy shit. Dan! 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 Fucking hell! You bastard! That should be an easy shot to get. Yeah. Then... Uh... Let's see if we could actually get this with... What? Okay then. I was very confused at what was going on there. Uh, take a critical... Take another critical. <laughs> All right, so we're going through this pretty well, I will say. Ah. I can use the compound key here. Dan, you. So they gather people up, torture them, and all for the safe test? The sick bastards need to be put down. The cell's empty. Damn it. Please. I got a kid. I... Do you want another treatment? That's ah, the same no. posters. Again, congratulations, hmm. you made it onto a baseball team. Which position do you prefer? My god. I've already told you. Catch bloody up. cell, bloody mattress, what the hell? Again, which position? Catcher, right? Be the catcher. Why? I I don't know. They, they got the, the funny... The funny helmets. I saw a picture when I was a kid. Hmm. Do Sims even know the rules of baseball? No, please. I'm not. Uh, just let me. No! Just answer the questions and only the questions. Congratulations, you made it onto a baseball team. Which position do you prefer? Catcher.
Why was that machine gun turret blue? Ah, okay. There's a gear. There's the gear for our uh, other tur turret. Has to see. Losing Montgomery is a mistake. I don't care if Covenant is lacking medical assistance. Our limiting factor isn't stream of tests. So I'm like going through Covenant. It's our acquisition. Acquit. Acquis. Acquisition rate. There we go. <laughs> of test negatives in our research bandwidth. Mon Montgomery. Montgomery is far more important here than giving than giving scavers scavers checkups. Can you please talk to Chambers about this? Oh, you mean the person that I blew into pieces with the shotgun with this shotgun? Who's there? Uh, no one. I wasn't quite sure I could actually have made that shot. Hey. Okay, that's a weird glitch that's been going on. Alright, I, I finally figured out what was going on on those other bat shot shots. It was... The scope going into range. Yeah, you don't... You didn't think that all three of your buddies laying there was a suspicious thing? Hmm. Yeah, just keep lining up. Oh god, okay. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> I mean, I would say that too if I just saw my friend get killed. Oh my god! Oh, okay, so this is the chained door. Alright. Hello there. <clears throat> and here you are. My life's work on the verge of ruin, all because of your efforts to find Stockton's supposed daughter. You do know she's most likely a synth, yes? If you are more than a hired gun, perhaps we can stop this before it's too late. Oh, so you are against synths. Okay. Stockton's daughter is a synth. Why else do you think we attacked her caravan? After testing. We have well over a 70% confidence level of our initial diagnosis. I'd have to perform an autopsy, to be sure. There's nothing you can say that can excuse what I've seen here. Everything we've done has been to stop the suffering of more innocents at the hands of the Institute and their synth menace. Covenant is many things. A refuge for the broken people left in the wake of the Institute's rampages place of safety and healing but most importantly it is our one chance to end this age of paranoia I will make you a deal if you let me dispose of Stockton synth and continue our work I'll match whatever reward you were offered I've had my fill of crazy on this contract no deal fortunate for me I wasn't talking to you you side with this nut job, and we're going to have a serious, deadly problem. <laughs> you do look menacing back there. Um, don't worry. I... <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, that, that's actually funny. Like, don't get me wrong. I do agree with her on, on the part of, you know, the Institute is, you know, absolute bastards. But I don't agree w with her with the sense being a menace. Maybe the, you know, maybe the Gen 1s and Gen 2s, but that's because they're, you know, under their employment, and a lot of these other scents out in the world is not. Yeah, I mean, they're... no. Yeah, no. No, 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 no. Sorry. That's a deal I won't accept. Then you'll just have to kill me. All right. What do you have to say about this? Hey, Dan. Some people up ahead. I'll follow your lead. Okay. Hello there. 
<clears throat> Please don't hurt me. It's all right. You're safe now. Oh, it's a little oh, bit too you. close. Thank you. I'm Amelia Stockton. I'm not a synth. All right. My father will be. My a God. He will. That's a little too me. close. Just let me out, please. <laughs> that was a little bit too close to to her face. Um. Okay, I guess it was uh, the first I cell. I'm free. I'm never ever coming back here. Hey, Dan. So Stockton gets his daughter, and we get paid. Not a bad day. We did it. That we did. Here's your cut of the reward. I'll get my half from Stockton. In a pleasure. You holding out on me? They call me Honest Dan for a reason. That's exactly half of what Stockton agreed to pay me. Not one cap more, not one cap less. Be safe, Dan. Same to you. Did she already run off? I wouldn't mind actually talking to her again. I guess she wouldn't exactly talk to me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I... <laughs> uh, I don't really care that I, uh... And to be honest, everyone has died. <laughs> everyone has died in this um in this quest. Besides uh besides Amelia and Honest Dan. Which I mean, I don't know. In my book, that's a that's a pretty good uh that's a pretty good day. <laughs> but yeah, I mean it's the thing about it is and the, one of the reasons why I just went ahead and killed her is because she would more than likely set up shop somewhere else and just and just start doing this again so I don't feel any regret or anything about that because what she was doing was just completely in my opinion messed up so yeah I uh no qualm qualms about that Well, with that distraction out of the way, I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, next time, I am going to continue uh, on with our quest, or our original quest, with going to County Crossing and the uh, Hugo's Hole. So, yes, that's going to be fun. Uh, and now we also have another uh, settlement at, as, uh, at Covenant. So, yay, that's, uh, that's fun. <laughs> uh, and hopefully the Covenant won't become unallied to us like um, like Tim Pines Bluff. Does that mean we're going to have to go back to Tim Pines Bluff and do another mission for them? That's interesting. Huh. It, questions for the future. But yeah, <laughs> next time we're going to continue on doing what we're going to do with... Uh, uh, with these settlement missions, more than likely we're going to get distracted by with something else, knowing us. Anyway, but yeah. Anyways, hope you enjoyed this uh, this episode. If you did, please give it a like. If you want to see more of this content, please hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you freaks and geeks in the next episode. Bye. Bye.